Turtles and tortoises are amazing. They are a keystone species for their environment. So if a turtle is native to a certain area, a certain ecosystem, they have a role to play, whether they're seed dispersers, burrowers, burrowers like a desert tortoise will provide home to like snakes, rabbits, insects, owls, all sorts of things. Without them, their ecosystems start collapsing. The Turtle Conservancy is a nonprofit organization that was founded in 2005. Its mission is to protect turtles and tortoises and their habitats worldwide. The center itself kind of acts as an arc to protect and conserve a lot of these different turtles and tortoises. We have these assurance colonies here at the Turtle Conservancy's Conservation Center where we're keeping genetic diversity alive in hopes of one day being able to release them into their native habitats. My favorite turtle or tortoise, they're Aldabra tortoises, and they're the second largest species of tortoise following Galapagos, and they're just amazing. I had never met one until I had come to the Turtle Conservancy. They're, they're gentle giants, whereas Galapagos are kind of like bulldozers. They just plow through whatever. Evolution takes time, well, a long time, usually, and what humans, what Homo sapiens are doing to the planet is just going so quickly. A lot of these animals that have been around for millions of years and have evolved to naturally fit into like their niches or their ecosystems, um, they've been able to slowly evolve with the changes, but the dramatic changes that humans are implementing on the planet, these animals have no chance to evolve with it. One of the best things you can do is just educate yourself about your local turtle species. If you're visiting a national park where turtles are native, or any animals are native, leave it better than you found it and just support organizations like the Turtle Conservancy who can actually make a larger impact.